Yo, what's up guys and girls? Um, I was just sitting here um, being idle, uh, which always leads to nothing good. And I had a Beatles song stuck in my head. And so I was trying to figure it out. I found some tabs for it and I figured I would show you what I found and um, maybe you could try it and, you know, probably do a much better job than I. So uh, the song is called Norwegian Wood. Um, it's America's you know, the uh, favorite uh, Pyromania song. Uh, if you don't know, that's what the song is about. Uh, it's about arson. Uh, so, <clears throat> it's, it's a pretty simple song. Um, obviously, the Beatles have, you know, a certain nuance to them. I am nowhere near the Beatles. Uh, I'm not even near the Ruttles. But, um, I figured I'd show you the, the chords for the song. i uh, show you the little sitar part of it. And, um... Yeah, maybe you want to try it out for yourself. So I, I'm still learning the song, but I'll show you what I've got. So, um, yeah, we'll figure it out together. So this song is actually played with uh, capo, 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 whatever you want to call it. Um, I'm sure you don't need one. You could probably play it in a higher key. Um, but what I found calls for a capo. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to put that on our second fret. And just so you're aware of what a capo does... <laughs> That's standard tuning. And we'll go ahead and put that guy on there. And it brings it up, okay? Now these are new guitar strings. I just put them on, so they're probably still stretching. So, <coughs> excuse me, it may sound a little wonky because the strings are still stretching out. Any excuse I can find, it, you know, it's why I sound crappy. I'm just gonna go for it. So anyway, uh, the chords are pretty simple. Um, there is a D chord. Okay, uh, there's a C, a G, uh, back to a D, all right? Um, and then there is uh, a D minor, okay? And a D minor is, what is a D minor? <laughs> this one, this one, and then this one, okay? Uh, and then back to a G. And then, of course, there's the E minor, which are just these two strings right here, second fret, fourth and fifth strings, okay? And then an A, which is the second, third, and fourth strings on the second fret. Or you could play it barred, which is how I tend to play it. Um, straighten it out there, okay? So that's it. Um, and basically, it goes something Sort of like this. So it's um I once had a girl, or should I say she once had me? She showed me her room, isn't it good? No we So it's Norwegian wood. It's a, it's a real quick chord change. C, G, D. Okay? And the second part is, um, starts off with a D minor. It's, um, whoops, it's a D minor. She asked me to stay and she told me to sit anywhere. That's the, the part that's like really tricky is just that real quick chord change. Uh, drinking a wine. All right. It's time for bed. C, G, D. All right. <clears throat> and then you get into that weird sitar thing because George was going through that, uh, you know, um, they were all going through that transcendental phase. So they, you know, he threw the, the sitar on there. Um, so obviously I don't have a sitar, but it's, uh, this is a little tricky. So it's going to be. Okay. 
okay? So it's gonna be on the third string, and you're gonna go uh, two, all right, so it's two, four, two, open, then fourth string, four, two, back to the third string, open, then back to the fourth string, fourth, and then open, then second string, third fret, okay, or fifth string, I'm sorry, fifth string, then you're going to go up, <clears throat> same fret, play it open, okay, does that make any sense? Um, so it sounds like this. Now just imagine. Uh, so then that's pretty much it, right? Uh, and then it goes back to. Um, she told me she worked in the morning and started to laugh. into the uh... I always mess that last part up all right I'll try and do a close-up here so you see what's going on uh... <clears throat> excuse me So, okay, it's all in that, those strings right there, so. And that's the song. Um, <clears throat> I'm still learning it, sort of. So those are the chords. Again, it's a D. That's the, and then your, your hook is the D minor. She asked me to stay and she told me to sit anywhere. D minor to a G, all right? <coughs> Excuse me. So I looked around and I noticed there wasn't a chair. E minor. To an A. All right. And then back to that D. Maharishni Yogi uh, solo. Ah, there you go. So uh, I would suggest looking it up. And again, I'm playing it capoed on the second fret. I suppose you could, I don't know, I guess you could probably play it uh, without the capo, but it would be a, a lower, uh, I don't know. I guess you could. She showed me her room. Isn't it good? Wood. So I, I guess you could, but it's they prescribe playing on this on the second fret capoed up. Um, and I'm sure guitar masters out there. Uh, I'm not even a novice. 
uh, will tell you there's all other ways to play this and such and whatnot and so forth and all that. But um, either way, like I said, it was stuck in my head and I wanted to pick it up and I didn't uh, have any good common sense, so that's why I put myself on the film. But either way, um, check it out, try it yourself, and um, we'll see how you do. All right, thanks for watching. Catch you guys in the next one.